Oh, it's that time of the year. I wanna back down over Mohalan. I wanna ride. I genuinely think I get smiled at more than most people a day, which is lovely. Like, it's nice to be smiled at. Out into nothing. Mate. Gonna leave just my this world for a while. And now I'm free. I first came interested in busking when I was about, uh, I was about 17, 18. Uh, I saw a bloke down on the waterfront who was playing one of my favourite Bob Dylan songs in a harmonica on his deck playing the guitar. It was just really cool. I kind of wanted to do that. I like that a lot. I like the way you work it, no diggity. I like to bag it up, no. I like the way you work it, no diggity. I like to bag it up. Oh, don't you know that girl looks good? Definitely gets his musical side from his Alison side, not Alison herself, because <laughs> <laughs> Alison seems like a dream. Being funny and I, I ain't got the breaks and I ain't got the. Five years ago, he was um, bunking five... off school. Yeah, room, yeah. And Ugh. you know all those stresses of being a parent where you can't. Um... Out of control. No, I ain't got the makings of a man who deserves, and no, I ain't got the size. He, he, he didn't do too bad in his GCSEs. His, his A levels, he didn't really. He didn't. He, he didn't apply himself because it was of no interest to him, I suppose. And then, um, and then he went to ATM, Access to Music, and it was like, it was like, the on button had been pressed. Well, he'd found his spot, really, and he loved it, and he loved it from the word go. Well, he came back and he said, I'm the only one in college with 100% attendance. I said, 100%? You? <laughs> What's going on? I'll be riding the money, right on time, thank you. I think my family, um, like, they get it, like, at least. They get they get why I busk. Um, it, it was my mum's idea originally. Like she was she was the one who said, "Oh, wait, just like go do it." So I did. It was a natural step, really. I think for him to do it. Well, he was always doing productions in school, wasn't he? Mm. Junior school, always up on the stage, mouthing everyone else's lines and things, wasn't he? Yeah. <laughs> Where about his safety? No, no. He's big and ugly enough to look after himself, isn't he? <laughs> There was one time where I was busking and a woman walked past. She pretended to put money in and then she, uh, what she did was just take money out. Um, so, I mean, that never happened to me before, so it was really, I was really shocked. So I just sort of said down the mic, can someone stop that woman? She's just stolen some of my money. Um, I, I, I don't know, I, just, I, it was, I didn't really know what to do because that had never happened to me before. It's, no, it was, it was really odd. And she came back, she said, I only, only took a pound. I said, well, it's still not your money, is it? Like, I mean, I'm more than happy to help someone out. But if you're going to be sly about it, then it's just not the best way, is it? It's a shame. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. You cry all the time. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. You cry all the time. In a day, I think the most money I made was about £150 last Christmas, which is great. I did the exact same thing next day as well. It was a really good weekend. I kind of a uh, bit addicted to it now. I kind of have to do it because it just makes me so, it makes me feel so good. So it's, it's difficult not to. We do it because we love it. If we came out and didn't make any money, it's not the end of the world because we just do it for fun. I feel very proud of it. 
and I love to see people's expressions on their face, whether it's good or bad. I don't play it for money, I play it for the heart. I can't change, even if I try, and even if I want it. Um, I went for Prince Got Talent last year. I did the audition. I was I, I I was waiting for nine hours. The audition lasted about a minute, and I went home again. And um, I didn't get called back. And I just feel like I really. I don't know. I just I just didn't see it as as worth my 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 time. Five years. I will be two years out of my degree. I would definitely like to be writing with um, as many people as possible. I mean. In an ideal world, world, I'd like to be gigging all over the country and having a great time, but we all know it isn't that simple. Um, I'd like to be in London. Makes me, makes me like Virtues, my love is a to him word. He hears on my behalf. Gentle and potion makes me, makes me light her. He hears on my behalf. Teardrop on the fire. It's, it's quite surreal being here, actually. It's quite odd. Because obviously, Bristol is a. Uh, it's, it's a city, but it's, it's still quite small in comparison. It's, it's, it's mad. I got off at Paddington earlier, and for a second, I had that like, uh, one minute of like, oh my god, this is brilliant. And then, as soon as people started uh, rushing past me, and I found myself walking an extra 20 miles an hour, it just changed the tone completely. And then trying to find e uh, eastbound, westbound, southbound, northbound on the lines. <laughs> really quite difficult. I'm actually genuinely shocked I made it all this way, but here I am. It's a lot busier than Bristol, so I'm quite excited to see what happens now. You can hold a hand and show her how you cry. Explain to her your weakness. Yeah, I think he's a very good singer. He's got a unique voice, and there's a gap in the market for him. I think like he's very original with Camden as well. Like there's a lot of diverse and um, things going on here, so like it's quite you can find a loophole here. I don't know. Just, X like, are 24 yeah, basically. <laughs> Tremble for yourself, my man. You know that you've seen us all before. It's a lie, your man. You never settle any of your scores. Type in Connor Knapp, C O double N O R. Uh, Knapp, K N A double P. Like Red Knapp. No worries. Thanks for sticking around, guys. You know, Cheers. Plastic. You're cynical and sarcastic, and you end up in the corner on your own. Well, I hear love to be loved, but I can't stand the rejection. I hide behind my jokes as a form of protection. Thought I was close, but under further inspection. Seems I've been running in the wrong direction. There's machinery enough to make my selection. I jumped right in if it wasn't for my ear infection. All I yeah, it was really good. That was, that was awesome then. Love that. You don't, like, you don't get that in Bristol anymore because everyone's seen it and there's like not so many people and you come here and like everyone actually stops and listens and like stops outside a busy street and is actually listening which is really nice and that one girl filming for what seemed like ages, it was lush, that's really nice. And I don't want the world to see me. I've come to London, a place that I've been to only ever to watch rugby when I was younger and um, now I'm coming here on a completely different basis where um, I'm singing like the songs I like to sing and uh, everyone's walking past, see we're chucking a bit of money, even if we're not having a listen, filming, genuinely taking interest in my name and that is the reason why I'm here. I've gonna pull my ticket out I'm gonna make my way out of my one horse. Um, and I 
I'll pack a suitcase with it Going somewhere with a name that's hard to pronounce So I might 